Hello guys, welcome to Delegate Co. And this video guide will help you to install the operating system on virtualizer based VPS. So in this case, we are taking up an example on which we are trying to install an operating system. The processes are very simple. In future, maybe interface change, but the steps and the process are the same. So in this case, I will go to the services and click on my services. After that, here I can able to see that there is an active service. I will open that. And when you scroll down, you will find here it is loading some control panel options. And this is called as a virtualize and here I would like to install an operating system to install an operating system I will click on install here you will find the various options are there so in this case let's say I wanted to install Debian 11 here you install and here enter the password and re-enter the password please make sure that remember this password it is extremely important because this will be your administrator or root password in this case if you are into installing for the Linux you can able to enter this and click on reinstall please make sure that while doing the reinstall all the data exists on the server will get deleted to avoid this first take the backup if you are reinstalling the operating system or else if you are doing first time then no worry just directly click on reinstall one more thing if it is a windows operating system so that time one thing has to be make sure after completion of windows installation you have to restart the system after completion of the windows operating system when you are installing a linux based operating system so that time it is not required to restart the system but in windows we need to restart the system so that time we have to first stop the system and then restart the system or start the system. Let me show you how. Let me refresh it. After 5 minutes, I will try to refresh this. And you can see that our operating system is live now means our debian 11 installed successfully here if it was a windows operating system so that time what we did it so that time we should have to first stop the vps scroll down click on ok you can see that the vps has been stopped now we have to start the vps this is only required for the windows operating system once system rebooted now you can able to use putty this is a putty or rdp to connect your system if it is a linux then you have to use the putty and if it is a windows then that time you can able to use rdp that is a remote desktop connection for this demonstration i will show you how you can able to log in into the putty here i will copy this ip address go to the putty enter here if port number is changed you can able to enter here but in this case default port number is so i will click on open after that click on accept and enter the username as a root if it is a windows it will be administrator if it is a linux that time it is a root now enter your password and hit enter similar case with the windows and this is how you can able to install your very first operating system